So I told you a bit about Tusker, um, but there's five more tracks on the album, so let me tell you a bit about those. Well, in Orange Fair, for example, I, that was the first one I ever wrote. And for me, that was, I mean, I had that chord progression kind of kicking around since I was like 16. Me and my friend, uh, Brian, Brian Fahey in uh, New York, we kind of, I had this, I had the chord progression. I was like, here, just play this on drums. And he was like, what the fuck is that? Because then we ended up counting it. And it was like 27 beats. It was like, dude, why are you writing something in 27 beats? I was like, I don't know. Just like play it, can you try? And so we found out a like kind of easy way to play, which is a lot of pretty close to how it sounds on the record, actually. I mean, yeah. And um, for me, it was just kind of about wanting to capture this that sort of strange feeling of nostalgia uh, that kind of evoked for me by. Um, Seeing this, seeing a fairground actually. Uh, I mean, I used to love going to the fair, obviously, who didn't when they were a kid. But um, years later, actually, I mean, like maybe 10 years after, obviously, the last time I'd gone to the fair, I was driving along uh, this interstate in, uh, in Albany and saw the whole fairground in, uh, in storage. Like, in this pretty crappy looking warehouse in the outskirts of town and just sort of really it was very strange feeling of nostalgia you know that sort of feeling when your heart kind of goes into your stomach but it's not out of nervousness it's just sort of being transported back in time in a weird sense so I only had that chord progression for the longest time so I when I re remember that uh, fairground I was just sort of like okay I need a melody for this and turn it into a song so I just sat down with the chords two times around three times around and the melody came into my head I just notated it right there done